hello everyone uh, we are going to find out tie set matrix so here a graph is given to you as you can see this is the graph which is given to you and there are some rules to find tie set matrix so first, first of all you have to select a tree from this given graph as per your uh, as per my convenience I have taken this tree a tree is simply the connection between nodes with these edges and a spanning tree is basically a tree which contains all the vertices so it is basically to select a spanning tree so I have covered all the vertices included in this graph you can take this as well it also containing all the vertices this is one of the possible tree which, which you can take uh, for this graph so what what you have to do after taking a tree you have to join each edge or you can just make that as dotted you have to join each edge only once so you have to possible all the edges in that in the same way which are in the original graph suppose I have joined one here so one is already present in here say as you can see six and three so first of all I have joined one then I have joined six then I have joined three okay so as you can see as you can see I have joined one here so I have taken the direction of that edge uh, that edge uh, which is one so I write just tie set one and just follow the direction one two four okay now for that I have joined this six edge six okay to the spanning tree so you have to consider the effect of only one edge okay at once you cannot connect all the edges at the single time you have to just consider the effect of only one edge only at one time then tie set six I am writing it uh, one because by connecting one I am getting this set tie set so here I am by connecting six I am getting this tie set tie set six is equal to okay, tie set six is six four five so what you have to keep in mind when you are forming the main matrix and for this I am just connecting three so tie set three three five two so now we have to make our original matrix now we are going to construct our tie set matrix 1 2 3 4 5 6 these are edges and what are the 1 1 3 and 6 1 3 and 6 are are our tie set okay so as you can see first of all we will consider one in this graph we have taken the direction as the direction of one so one two four as you can see one is in uh, so we have taken this direction one is in the same direction so in same direction we will take plus one uh, two is also in same direction we will again take plus one and four is again in the same direction so we will take plus one so one for one one edge is same direction, two edges in same direction, four edges also in same direction. Other are not in contact, so therefore zero. Similarly, in tie set three, I have taken this direction, so three is in the same direction. Oh, I have missed three, so just take it zero here. Uh, I have taken three in the same direction, so take it plus one. Two is uh, if we go through this five is on five is also in the same direction so plus one but two is in the different direction so take it minus one and rest are zero for six six is in the same direction so take in plus one four is in the direction opposite to the direction of six as you can see this is this direction and four is in opposite to that so minus 1 and 5 is also in opposite direction then 
minus 1 and rest are 0. So we have constructed our tie set matrix successfully.